Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm just here to show you some projects that I've been working on today. I got up early this morning so that I could get some crafting in. Um, so I'm just gonna dive right in. I have quite a few things that I've made. Um, so the first thing that I made, I made some gatefold cards. Oh my God, is that not cute? Um, this is Doodlebug, um, so punny. I love, love, love this paper. It's adorable. Um, so I did layer regular cardstock and then of course this is the pattern paper from the collection Then I created a belly band and I, I layered everything on black just to make everything pop And then I just kind of covered up the belly band uh, with some some more of the uh, collection paper And I used some nesting dies here that I have and just layered a couple of those and this is one of the uh, stickers that you can get that come with the collection which is absolutely adorable and I love that soda pop paper, it's so cute. And this is also, uh, the heart is one of the ephemera pieces as well as this one that says, you're a cut above the rest. Absolutely adorable, I love this paper. It's so fun and vibrant, really pretty paper. And then on the inside, I layered some more, um, just regular plain uh, colored cardstock with some white cardstock. This is one of the cardstock stickers that came with the collection if you buy the 12 by 12 kit. Um, so I put that in there as the sentiment, which I absolutely love. And I put everything on black just so all the colors would pop that much more and look more vibrant. But I absolutely love, love, love that. And then the second one that I did, which I did three gatefold cards, so they're all going to be um, pretty similar. Um, this is the cream and sugar, which I love that. Look at the donuts. Isn't that cute? And then for to cover up the belly band on this one, I did like a sprinkle paper that was with the collection. And then again, I used my nesting dies, and this was one of the ephemera pieces, as well as the coffee, which is so adorable. And then I'll slide this one open so you can see this one as well. And then on this one, I just did uh, some hot pink paper with some white. And then this little, uh, the Hershey Kisses are also a part of the ephemera pack, which I love. This is such cute paper, it's so fun. And then the last one that I did is a Simple Stories paper, which is called Emoji Love. And again, I did the same belly band deal there. That's one of the ephemera pieces, but I love this paper with the French fries and the cute little tennis shoes. This was in the ephemera pack. And then on the back, I did that same uh, pink heart paper that was from the collection. And then let me open this one. I haven't done gatefold cards in a, in a while. It's, they're su super simple to make, but there's a lot of la paper layering. And then in here I did some more of the pink paper, one of the ephemera pieces that says emoji love. So I love how these came out and I love the fun colors that I used. The next thing that I'll show you is I was on Pinterest. Of course, I always get um, a lot of great ideas from Pinterest and I wanted to try to make some paper cups that were unicorns. So here's the first one that I did. And I had to hand do everything, I don't have a die. So <clears throat> I just used one of my larger circle punches. And I what I did for the eyelashes, I did a one inch circle punch and then I just kind of went along the edges and then I drew in the eyelashes. And then I punched out all the flowers and layered them and um, the ears I had to cut out, the, the little uh, unicorn horn I cut out. So very cute. Next time I think I'll make the eyes just a little bit lower, but turned out super cute. How fun. And then I did one more. So this one is also a unicorn, but I did it without the face. So I just kind of did the top of the unicorn. Adorable. And this one I put lots of flowers and I got some leaves on there. Then I put some gold stickles on the ears on this one. And there's little blingy gems in some of the flowers. So very cute and fun. I wish there was a die that <laughs> was small enough to make paper clips, but it was fun. I, you know, just a lot of, um, I used a lot of my dies and a lot of my, and all of these actually for this one, I actually hand cut out all the flowers, everything that you see, except for the flowers themselves. I did use a little small flower punch that I have and just layered a whole bunch of fun, really pretty colored flowers um, to go across the top of it. So turned out super duper cute. 
And then the last thing that I made is um, I was doing a D stash and going through my Sizzix dies and I found a die that I absolutely love and haven't used it in a long time. So what I did was I created um, these little policy envelopes and I just came up with the measurements myself to create these. Um, so my intention is for these to be like um, little gift card holders. So I used the Tim Holtz um, coffee die and I just layered and um, I used my scallop die for this one. And there's another one under there. It's kind of tucked under there. And I just used some really fun paper. I can't remember the name of this paper line, but it's so adorable. So I did this kind of cup as well as this one. And you'll see that I kind of did that on all of them. So that's the first one. And then here's the second one. Love, love, love how these came out. So super cute and the little policy envelope there. And then here's another one. Adorable. And this is a die. I think I sold this in my store a long time ago. And I used that and I just put some gems on the corners of the super cute glasses. And I just, um, I have a paper pad that's all like foil, just plain foiled paper. So I used that adorable and the paper itself has glasses on it so stinking cute and then here's the next one and this is the fashionista paper that i if you watch my last haul video i picked this up at hobby lobby and i love those little shoes adorable and then i just put this one on, on a pink policy envelope so that's like a perfect size to stick a little um, gift card in there. And I do give away a lot of um, Starbucks gift cards, so I thought this would be cute. But you could actually put any gift card. It doesn't have to be coffee, a coffee one. And then here is the very last one with the cute little owls on it. So stinking cute. I love it. And it was fun to play with my dies. There's, I, I have, yeah, of course, like everybody else, I've collected so many dies and sometimes it's you forget to circle back to them but it's turned out really cute and I absolutely love how everything turned out so thank you so much for stopping by I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your Sunday um, and have a good Monday tomorrow so I will talk to you guys very soon bye